job. They don't call it. They let it sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Looking guy, isn't he? Well, five hours to New York. Oh, five hours. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My, what a handsome couple. Yes. And isn't she beautiful? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Eddie, where are you going to stop in Paris? At the American Farm. <laughs> Drink a sign of beer for me in Germany. Uh -huh, I'll drink five of them. <laughs> what a sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> you know, everything excites me funny. <laughs> hey, so you folks better get inside and you'll spend your honeymoon in the hospital. Yeah, maybe you're right. <laughs> Bye. 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 Okay. Still yeah, just a few dollars, honey. <laughs> but you wait till I get to Monte Carlo. <laughs> With your luck, you'll probably break the bank. Oh. oh, dear. Your husband is lucky in cards, too. Oh, thank you. But I'm the lucky one. Uh, oh, no, 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 precious. I'm the lucky one. No, I am. Well, now, listen, darling, I, I hate to argue with her, but I think I'm just a little wee bit luckier than you oh, are. No. You know what I mean. I'll decide. You're both lucky. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll be in New York in a few minutes. Oh, I guess we better quit and wash up. Oh, say, I hate to quit winter. Oh, forget it. Let's see, how much do I owe you? Sound dear, you owe Mr. Gray $196. <laughs> Brother, with your luck. <laughs> luck? Why, he knows how to play. <laughs> now, let me see. 196 added to the 5,000 we have. That lacks $4 of being 5,200. <laughs> Looks like a pretty swell honeymoon, doesn't it? Oh, the best I was ever on. <laughs> oh, you know what I mean, Fred. <laughs> oh, you know what I mean, Fred. Thank you, kid. <laughs> Don't mind us, will you? No, you only have one honeymoon. <laughs> Stick to your own racket and lay off the Pullman. It'll be lots safer riding for you. You get me? Thank <laughs> <laughs> you, Miss Dallas. Say, uh, uh, Dolly, uh, where's a good place to eat in New York? Why, uh, the best place is at our house. Oh, we don't want to impose on you. Forget it. You're only going to be in New York one night. What do you say? What do you say, Baby Kim? Well, whatever you want to do. No, no, no. Now, you decide. No, sweetheart. You decide. Well, you see, being our first night, I, I thought that this, it would be awfully... Well, you think we only intended to... Uh... That's fine. We'll take you to the hotel to change your clothes and all go over to our house. Oh, really? It would be much homier than a hotel. Well... I don't see how we could refuse very well. Uh, I don't either. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad we met you. <laughs> that was a delightful dinner, Mrs. Whaley. Indeed it was, Mrs. Whaley. Thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I wonder where the butler is. Meadows! Meadows! Pardon me, Miss Whaley. Mine is this beautiful home. Just one of those little places. <laughs> little? <laughs> it's a palace, Mrs. Whaley. You know, we're going to have a home like this someday, dear. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> well, suppose you sit down. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> oh, sorry, Mrs. Whaley. Don't, never mind. Don't bother. Don't bother, Mrs. Whaley. Just sit down. Slippery. Cut it, cut it. Remember, you're the butler tonight. Okay, Charlie. And don't call me Charlie. All right, darling. Serve the cordial. She saw me and I saw her, and here we are. Oh, how thrilling. <laughs> it was thrilling. Here well, we are. These are Ooh, welcome. Thank you. Oh, thank you, madam. <laughs> thank you. Mrs. Whaley certainly has a wonderful chef. Yes, ma'am. The last place they had him, they kept him five years. Yeah. Meadows, the door. Okay, Bob. Uh, Ma'am. Well, you, you'll have to excuse him. You see, he's been in the family.
How many, please? One. Give me two. I'll take two. I'll bet these. Oh, a hundred dollars? Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, the white chips are the 50 cent ones. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I don't suppose I should take it back, huh? <laughs> well, it's not being done, according to Hoyle. <laughs> oh, and he's the father of poker, eh? <laughs> <laughs> if you're caught bluffing, you lose. <laughs> It'll cost you a hundred to find out. I hate to lay down three jacks, but <laughs> my threes are no good. Well, this flush isn't worth a hundred. Well, I guess I win then. <laughs> the streak of luck is still with you. Oh, it's not all luck. <laughs> Pair of aces. <laughs> From the way I do, you probably thought I had four of them, eh? <laughs> Deal me in. I'll be right back. <laughs> Come here. What's the matter with you? Do you want me to take you for a ride? I couldn't see the cards, Charlie. They was out of focus. Uh, don't blame it on the glasses. You're out of focus. Never mind the signals. We'll handle him without you. Look at that. Fourteen. You win, my dear. <laughs> there you are. Eight and a half dollars. <laughs> Isn't that marvelous? Give me a couple of good cards. And the dealer gets one. I'll bet 500. 500? That's a lot of money. I'll say. I think my hand's good for a bit of a raise. <clears throat> One thing annoys me is people who drink and can't handle it. Yeah. Meadows, sit down and behave yourself. Oh. Yes, sir. Five hundred more. That left me out. Whaley, you must have a good hand. I have. <laughs> well, I'm more than curious. I'll raise you five hundred. That'll cost me a thousand to say. That's right. Jenkins, uh, Jenkins, look. I want seventeen. Oh. How are you going? Oh, fine. No, 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 baby, can't peek. Oh. <laughs> Come on in and say, Mrs. Gray. Oh, Mrs. Gray. Oh, that's me. I get so excited whenever anyone calls me by my new name. 
Daddy, can, I'm going to take a chance with two dollars. Now, don't you bet heavily. Oh, no, 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 I won't, honey. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Isn't she cute? <laughs> what do you do, Gray? <laughs> oh, there's a lot of your money in there. What'd you say it cost me? One thousand. I'll say. Well, this is a big enough pot for me to win. I'll call. Jack's full on ten. Why not so fast? King full on aces. Ah, wait a minute. I had him this time. Four queens. Who will be? Oh, oh, baby, 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 honey. Oh, baby, look what I've won. Who will be? Who will be? Baby, king. Four queens. You ready for a drink? Now! You should squawk at me. You're the guy that's out of focus. I tried to tell you, he had four ladies. Ladies, don't you get it? Ladies. Ah, you're cockeyed. And you? What's the matter? You got the rheumatism? Where were the readers? Why didn't you work them? I didn't know it was time. Time! And he's got 5,000 of our dough, and it's not time? Hey. Slippery. Don't let him get out of the house. You'll probably win now. Uh, Say, what's the matter with you, bird? Making him a wedding present? Yeah. And if you don't lay off that stuff... Uh, go in there and separate him and get Gray back here. Now, you guys get organized. Hey, cut that out. After the boner you pull up. I need it. Uh, it's getting awfully late, honey. I think we ought to go. Yeah, as soon as you can break away without being rude, we'll leave. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, say, honey, you never saw such cards in all your life. <laughs> oh, Eddie. <laughs> yes. Uh, the boys are waiting for you. Uh, of course. <laughs> all right, darling. Daisy's <laughs> uh, a little tired, boys, so I think it's about time to be going home. Oh, 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 oh I think we got a job. Sure, we might. Oh, huh? oh, let's play another half hour. Yes, you're not going to quit it. Well, it's all right with me, but you know the wife. Uh, just you know, a couple more hands. Yeah, just a couple more. Well, of course, if you insist, why, well, I suppose the only sporting thing to do is play a few more hands. <laughs> <laughs> Put down your basket. Huh? Uh, oh. <laughs> there we oh, are. You're certainly <laughs> giving me some expensive lessons. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to go and get some more money. <laughs> now, you know, it is rather embarrassing. <laughs> I seem to be the only winner. <laughs> well, don't let that bother you. It's my deal. Mm -hmm. Oh, taking money from behind the wife's back, eh, Charlie? <laughs> naughty, naughty. Still a sense of humor. <laughs> oh, win or lose, I'm just the same. <laughs> How are you coming, Gray? Oh, Mr. Gray's in the hole. Two thousand. Oh, oh I'm three thousand in the hole. That's right, three thousand. I forgot. I think I need a little air. Maybe Meadows could take you for a little ride. Isn't it awfully late to go riding? Ah, ah, ah. Darling, aren't you sleepy? No. Uh, yes. yes. How much have we with, with my fourteen dollars? Um, fourteen dollars. No, I mean our five thousand plus what you won and my fourteen dollars. The total. Oh, oh, the, oh, oh, uh. Fourteen dollars. Oh, quick, you're joking. Why, Eddie Gray, what happened to our money? I lost it at the Whaley's. You mean our European trip, our honeymoon, everything gone? Gone. Oh. Yes, but I can, I can hock my watch and my wristwatch and get enough money to get back home. Oh, back home? Yes. Yeah. You think I could think the Vanderbilt's, the Browns, the Joneses, and all those people? And postcards in Europe? And the halls. And the m m m m McCoy? Rashmore's. Well, I won't do it. I'm going to Europe if I have to walk. The wet walk, dear. Yeah, but what can I do? Do? You can get out of here and leave me alone. I don't want to ever. Yeah, but now listen, honey. I don't think but I don't want to see you. Now listen, Casey. But I don't. I want... Listen. Honey. Honey, you're not going to put me out, are you? You are out. Oh, so I am. Five thousand dollars.
get home yet? No, Charlie. Any word since I phoned you the last time? No. What time did you say she left the house? She's in a telephone call just before dinner. I thought it was you. No, it wasn't me. She left right after that. Did she go out alone? <clears throat> yeah, in a taxi cab. It's the first time she's ever done that. I've warned her time and again never to leave the house alone. Did anybody phone me? No. Uh, yeah, do happens called a couple of times. Seemed mighty burned up. You wasn't here. Oh, that guy. I've got the money right here for him. He's crazy. Want to roll the bones a little? No. It's 11.30. Charlie, you're nervous. We better have a drink. Oh, give me ice water. I want to think. Hello, hello. Hello, is this Charlie Whaley? Yeah, who is this? Now, never mind, Whaley. It won't do you any good to know. I'm calling about your wife. My wife? What about her? Where is she? Now, don't get excited. She's all right, only she's not coming home until you promise to do just what I tell you to. Well, what's that? Listen, keep your shirt on and your ears open. All you have to do is go over to that little safe behind your wife's picture, open it, count out five grand, put it in an envelope, and throw it out the open window in front of you. You're crazy. We've got you covered through that same window. You and your dumb butler. So don't move an inch. Don't move. Your wires are tapped. If you try to call for help, you'll never see your wife again. After you throw out the dough, if anybody bothers the guy that picks it up, you'll never see your wife again. Do you get the idea, Charlie? It's perfect and painful. But, uh... Oh. Hello. Uh, oh. What's the matter, Charlie? Be quiet. <laughs> Sweetheart, that's a lot of dough, but you're worth it. Are you all right? Did they hurt you? Oh! Wait a minute, wait a minute. What are you talking about? Why, the kidnappers. Kidnappers? Here. No, you're not drunk. Are you crazy? Oh, well, where were you tonight? Why, only to the theater, and then for a little bite to eat at the cafe. Uh, who did you go with? I was Mrs. Gray. Uh, the wife of the staff that you trimmed last night. Didn't he phone? Did he phone? And I threw five grand out the window to him? What? He phoned. Oh! Oh! Did you get it? <clears throat> what? Did I get it? <laughs> oh, give it here. I'll take care of it. Oh! Huh? <laughs> the chump. And you're the clever Charlie Whaley. Oh, yeah. Hello, hello. It's all right, Whaley. And thanks for returning the 5,000. You hear that? <laughs> we're leaving immediately for Europe. And we're not stopping at Monte Carlo. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. <laughs> 